Not to be that girl, but can you talk about psilocybin and the brain some more? Psilocybin as in psychedelic mushrooms. Why yes, of course I can. There's a lot of cool research out there on psychedelics, so if you want a whole series on this, just let me know. But today I'm going to talk about this one study that I personally think is amazing. So psilocybin is known for producing feelings of unity or connectedness with other people or even animals. And in this study, people were given either placebo, control, or psilocybin and put into a virtual game. In that game, they were passing a ball around with other players when suddenly the other players stopped throwing it to them. They were purposely excluded. But consistent with the idea that psilocybin promotes feelings of unity, afterwards, those who took psilocybin reported feeling less excluded. But that's not all. They also did brain imaging during the game, and they found that those who took psilocybin showed less activity in certain parts of the brain that process social exclusion. Or in other words, as the authors wrote, psilocybin administration reduced the processing of social pain. Now what's especially interesting about this for me is the way that psilocybin works in the brain. Here's a hint, but I decided I'm going to make this a whole video series, so watch out for that.